Hello, my people. I just wanted to come on here so excited. You see this on this person on your page, Spigzo underscore AF, and reposted my thing saying this is the best page ever. And this is all in, you know, sarcasm. Now, let's look at the 75 comments and see who they are. Let's see who she is. Some non black, non white person. The Africans just invented the wheel. I just want to go through. Oh, that's that look like a Hispanic guy. Yep, that's him. Um, let's go back. Cause I feel like it's really it's really important that we keep a database of these people. And that you just realize that it's, it's, mo it's more than you think. And they're not just trolling and lying. Like, troll pages are t speaking their truth. A lot of these pages are by your friends. You call them troll pages when they should be truth pages. They're revealing themselves. Somebody who's not racist doesn't say racist things. I don't care if you do it. So, look. Like it's this person, whoever that is. And what I probably meant to say was that somebody who's not hateful won't say hateful things because this really has nothing to do with race. I believe, just like um, Dr. Umar said, that racism is about power and oppression and things like that. And, and your wife, who is a different color, can, can practice this power and oppression if she's not working to tear it down. She's, she's a cog in the will that supports it. And whether that's your best friend or whoever. Now these people, they express hatred. And you can look up whichever pages you want to. Some of it is very clear, so I don't gotta click on them. It's 75, I ain't gonna go through and click on all of them. They're in the slums now. And this is like some They say they have an American flag, but I feel like they are non-FBA, or non-African non American. Then they migrated here. You know what I mean? Or they're just a coon. Either way, they're a coon, so. You got some black people. Proves that worship the moon. See how many still believe in the white patriarchy? Because women are important in our culture. They say we worship the moon and we're weak, and that they worship the sun and that they're strong. Yes, and this thing right here, this comment, I want y'all to realize when y'all see somebody saying this, especially like a non-black person, I don't care if they're Asian or Hispanic, whoever, A-Rap, when they using this, because they said, oh, we were canes, this one too, this one too, Um, they're mocking you, they're, they're mocking African-American Ebonics because they think we all are ignorant and don't know and don't know how to speak proper grammar negative stereotype because a lot of them don't know how to speak any any kind of grammar I've experienced it see it's young and old it's not even old just like mid 30s some millennials in here and Gen Z like this guy Colin Payne.
this when we see this which they put that all over my account too that's a, they're mocking us so you just know that there's no they're full of hate when they do something like that and this was just we was kids but whole account oh okay so i think that's probably was some racist meme that went popular or something And this was even better. Yo, yeah, whenever we talk about the greatness of black people, this is an exposing the truth. There's no proof of a blue hat. Oh my gosh. They convince themselves, like, they have a delusion that everyone in history was blonde haired and blue eyed. Everybody great in history was blonde haired and blue eyed, that we were just savages and monkeys. Even though science says they have monkey DNA, so they're the monkeys. That's not racist. That's that's science. That's the truth. And if the truth is actually racist, then hey, accept it still. Um, and mutants. And that's that's this is an ironic comment because it's actually the the opposite for me. It's actually reverse. You know. They're lower, and I know what they are. That's why I don't, I just pity them, you know? This was coming for them. It's not, you know, gonna be pretty, but there will be an overturning and there will be a revelation, a worldwide revelation, and things will be flipped as it should be. But yeah, that's all. I guess let's read this one. Okay, and sorry, I just kind of woke up like an hour ago <clears throat> so I can read that I've come a long way because I can really read this and not feel anything but just pity and sometimes amusement but you know just they just prove everything I think about them, but like every post they make. And I want to prove it to you guys too. That's all. Because a lot of our people are getting killed because they love white people so much and think there are exceptions and all that. I'll just say cut them all out because you don't know which one is which. It's like trying to pick which wolf won't eat you when most of them will. They're not every single last one. Every, not every single last wolf or lioness will eat a gazelle. Sometimes they'll nurse them. Sometimes they'll nurture them. That doesn't mean trust all of them. That doesn't mean you can't talk negatively about the collective of them if that's just insubstantiated. That's what a lot of you don't get. Everything they do to us, we should be doing to them. Everything they said about us is actually true about them. That's the truth that they don't want to reveal. And, and it's like they demonized it. So anything. So when we actually do flip it, because the truth is to be, it was actually the reverse all the way around. They're going to be like, well, you just as bad as me because now you're, you're doing the same thing. You can't do the same thing back. No, but if it's right, I can. You know, that's just another tactic. The reverse is meant to be. What you were doing wasn't. It was It was meant to go this way. It was meant to go downstream, not up, upstream. Now that we're correcting things, it doesn't make me the same as you as, at all. So.